I want to short some Bitcoin. I was going to wait, but it keeps going down. And this is dangerous because, yes, the direction. Did you notice I took a screenshot so we don't forget the price? I've been tracking it. it keeps going down. Now, a lot of times we act on emotion and we short the bottom. So I have my account loaded up and ready. I'm going to start off at market. I am going to do the 2550. I'm going to ignore this. This is very important to ignore. Hold on, I have one Bitcoin here. Ignore the urge to short the bottom. I like five, but it's simple. What's the price? Three thirty. Look, nine thirty-nine. Thirty-eight. Now, just look at this arch. Where would you want to short? Down here? Really? Let me screenshot that. By the way, this tool is listed in the description box of my video. Scroll down. It says free. Um, I don't know. It's a Chrome extension. It's super cool. So again, if everything is about the size of the candles and all it does is go up and down and up and down, where do you want to enter your short? Here. I say we wait together. Let me show you how to deploy. Now, let's show you the math. One divided. Well, divided by four. Is your wallet management basic? So you got 0.25 to go into the trade. We enter at market. If you're at 50x, your fee to exit and fees are not everything. Fees are not everything. Your fee to get out is 7.5 percent. The lower leverage, the less money you are borrowing, essentially. Well, the lower your fees are. 25x is just too slow. It moves too slow. We want to be in and out rapid fire trades. 942. Well, you wanted to short at 938. Why am I not seeing 16 938? Because we trade on the small time frames. I could be in and out before you can open your eyes, and you would have shorted the bottom. Why? This is the three minute cycle. Don't let the one minute lure you in to pumps and dumps. So that's what you're allowed to put in a trade. If you want to do the best leverage, the best amount of speed, you do the 25.50. You cut your same order in half. 0.125, and you're gonna put thumb in at 0.5 at 50x, and the other half in at 25x. The result will be 38x, giving you a low fee of 5.5. So if you got 25%, about 20% of it is yours, and leaving you money, it'll leave you a half Bitcoin to go ahead and create your ALCMs and your protective barrier. And you can see why I didn't short at 9:38 or 9:45. Because following the three-minute cycle, I could see that it was going to go up. I watched two things: the price and the candles. Do you want to short at the bottom of the hill when the goal is to go down further, or the top of the hill? Do you want to long at the bottom or at the top? All it does is pump and dump, right? That's your lesson. Six-hour direction is indecisive. The one-hour, make sure you're on auto. The direction is taking over to the downside. Okay, and if you get four solid red bars, well, guess what? Your next candle is going to be red. So we're probably going to go from indecisive to red. But if you didn't learn this little three-minute cycle, you would have shorted the bottom, bro. Right there, right there, right there, right there. That's how we do it. I'm going to wait before I take any trades.